Here are some examples you will examples of questions that you will be getting uh, in the exam. Okay. Uh, well, the question asks us to state the domain and the range of the following graphs. Let's do this graph first. Okay, this is graph. This is graph one. Okay, let's do graph one first. So, point A, the graph is between point A and point B. Point A is an open circle, point B is a full circle. So point A is not included, point B is included in the graph. The domain is from minus 2 to 4. The horizontal distance of the graph is from minus 2 to 4. So to write it down here, domain is x belongs to open bracket minus 2 to 4 and square bracket here. The range is y belongs to so we look at the vertical value vertical y value for the range is from minus 8 to 64 and minus 8 not included so it's minus 8 and 64 square bracket. OK, so let's do question 2. OK, uh, from graph 2, let's do the domain first. OK, let's say the graph start from minus 8 and with a full circle to more to horizontal uh, minus 4 with an open circle and between minus 4 and minus 2 the, there's a gap so x cannot be any value between minus 4 and minus 2 from minus 2 to positive 6 there's a well full circle at my, uh, positive 6 so there's two paths of the domain is from minus 8 to minus 4 and minus 2 to positive 6. So in order to to write down the domain we have to use uh, union union symbol which means all. So I do an example here. The domain is x belongs to square bracket minus 8 to minus 4 sorry, sorry. Uh, round bracket union minus 2 to positive 6 round bracket okay this the union sum means also x can be any value from this range of numbers all this range of numbers. Okay, so let's do range. The range of this graph is y belongs to. We look at the graph is the lowest part is well minus twenty here, and it, well, it's always continuous, and here goes con there's no gap vertically. So uh, to 80 and uh, so it's round bracket minus 20 to 80 square bracket that's your range simple okay let's look at uh, graph 3 okay graph 3 here okay from graph 3 uh, you see some you see a dotted line here this line is called the asymptote basically this dotted line is at the asymptote um, the proper the asymptote is not a part of the graph your part of graph is here okay and uh, unlike unlike graph one in graph three there at both end of the graph there's no no dot points 
not not the full circle dot point or open circle dot point. So it means the graph keeps continuous going to infinity this way and uh, going to infinity this way down. But the asymptote indicates that the graph keeps approaching to the asymptote and never uh, reaches it. Uh, for example, let's say the asymptote is a vertical line on minus 5 here. Okay, this means the graph, the graph uh, keeps going, approaches, approaches minus 5, but never reaches minus 5 in here. Its x horizontal uh, x value never reaches minus five, but keeps approaching, keeps approaching for uh, infinity as a keeps going down. So here, the domain of this graph is x belongs to open bracket minus. Okay, write down, write it down somewhere. means x belongs to oh, sorry let's start again means domain is x belongs to square bracket from minus 5 to infinity okay okay oh, the problem infinity here and when you are uh, stating an uh, infinity on domain always use the uh, uh, round bracket okay because simply because you well you can't be equal to infinity it's infinity it's, well don't, don't worry about and uh, let's look at the range if the graphs keep going downwards and keep going upwards so we will have the range can be all the numbers we can have any values from this graph so the range is y belong to r okay all real numbers okay this question graph 3 let's look graph 4 Okay, graph 4 has a horizontal asymptote down there on the x-axis, which is the line y equal to 0. So, so in this case, it means, well, also there's no ending points at both ends. That means the graph will keep going upwards and keep going this way, and approaching 0, but never reaches it. So, similarly, Similarly, the domain. Okay, let's look at the domain of graph four. Will be all real numbers because it keeps going there. Uh, so just x belongs to r. All the numbers here, and the range will be because it. It will never touch touches the line uh, when y is zero, the horizontal line. So you you can't have a minus number or zero. So it will y is belongs to from zero to infinity. In other words, all the positive values, uh, yeah, all, all the positive values. The important thing you have to remember when doing when stating domain and range is just keep 
keep an eye on the open circle and asymptote. When there's asymptote and open circles, your domain is a uh, circle bracket. Okay, if dot circle here means well square bracket for uh, yeah for the domain and the range. So okay and uh, there are some okay if you're looking for some more uh, practice questions there are some practice questions on our website with full answers you can download it for free so please visit our website thank you okay see you next time